and welcome to my Dead Island series. Basically, um, it's gonna be one of my longest series. I've already recorded a bunch of episodes. I don't even know how many. Um, probably like thirteen or so. I don't know. Um, I've already well, I've recorded a bunch. Um, and during this recording. I'm only 18% through the game. I don't know when you're watching this. You could have watched it years after I uploaded it. I don't know. But, um... It's gonna be a really long game. I might even get to at least 100 episodes. And I might start making them, like, 20 minutes. Too, so, um... So I can get more progress in. Because the game's a lot harder than the first one. Like, there's a lot more zombies... So, it's, uh, I do a lot of my time running, or killing, or dying. I'm not that bad. I've got some experience from the first game. Um, I will not be recording the first game, because if you want to record it, thousands of YouTubers have already done it. It's just that Riptide's the newer one, and I don't want to go back and replay it, especially because I have, um, I already, I'm like OP on that. So, um, yeah, I, uh, hope you, uh, hope you enjoy. Hey guys, and welcome to my Let's Play of Dead Island Riptide. Um, I said I'd do this. Um, I don't believe Evan will be joining me in this series, uh, because, well, he's dealing with some issues, plus he's already played the game. Um, this game's fairly old. Um, I played the first one, this is why I want to play it, um, I'm not doing, uh, one on the first one, because, um, uh, well, it's so old, and, like, everyone's already played it already, so if you want to watch the first one, because this is the prequel to it, then you can, uh, you can, um, you can, uh, go do that, uh, there's thousands of YouTubers out here just done a Let's Play on Dead Island, uh, uh, the first one. So, uh, it doesn't look like there's a change in graphics. Hopefully the controls are the same. It's been a while since I've played this game, so. Oh, it's the same characters. Okay, well, I'm gonna play as the guy I played as in... Oh, I'm blunt weapon expert? What? Well, this is this is this is different than last time. This guy didn't even hit. This guy didn't even have a trait. That's why I picked him. And I usually use blade stuff. So um, this is the guy I played as in the last game. It'd be cool if I could have my weapons from the original game because like I have this OP in that game, and it didn't take much attack and ram and tackle enemies if I were blows ring fury. That's an enemy's flying. Right damage. I'm gonna play as him. When I was growing up in Orleans, all I ever wanted to do was rap. But man, I couldn't catch a break until who do you voodoo? <laughs> it was supposed to be a joke, but all of a sudden I was rich as shit. I had everything I ever wanted, man. Everything. Except respect. Nobody thought I was a real deal. Just some no talent one hit wonder. Hell, if I didn't start believing them. It's no surprise I'll never another hit after that. I ain't nothing to say. Well, you know what? I got something to say now. Didn't think I'd ever see anything as sad as Katrina. But this plague, what happened at the Royal Palms, what happened in Moresby, it's something out of goddamn horror movie, man. The dead are rising up against the living like it's the end of days, and maybe it is, but I gotta say, people do amazing shit when they up against it. The ones you think gonna stand their ground, they fucking run. And the quiet ones, the ones you don't even notice, man, they don't give an inch. They'll give up everything for somebody they don't even know. There's a song there somewhere. Shit. I don't even know if I'm gonna still be standing when all is said and done. But if I am, believe me, Sam B got something to say. Well then, actually, I'm gonna quickly do something first. I'm gonna go back to the main menu. And turn on subtitles for you guys. Oh, subtitles are on. 
I'm recording just for who he's coming down the stairs. When I was growing up in New Orleans, all I ever wanted to do was rap. Man, I couldn't catch a break until who do you voodoo? It was supposed to be a joke, but all of a sudden I was bitch and shit. I had everything I ever wanted, man. Everything. Balanced. Except respect. Yeah. Nobody thought I was a bitch. Besides, it's all in the whoopies. <laughs> My name's Perna, and I'm gonna tell you about the worst bloody holiday ever. I was at the Royal Palms Resort on Benoit, working as a bodyguard for some asshole CEO. I figured once he left the island, I'd have a good week to relax on the beach, enjoy a Mai Tai or two. But no, that wasn't to be. As I woke up one morning to discover that the goddamn zombie apocalypse had arrived. This is the first game. A local lifeguard by the name of Cinnamon saved my life. Soon after that, I discovered I was immune to whatever this plague was. I met a few others who were immune, and somehow we were all elected to save everybody else. There was Sam B. A one-hit wonder hip-hop star from the States, Logan, an ex-football player and full-time douchebag who never missed a chance to hit on him, and Shin Mei, a sweet little hotel clerk who was as brutal with a blade as anyone I had ever seen. Together, we went to Moresby to try to gather more supplies, and from there, things really went to hell. The army tried to contain the infection, but they were bloody useless. Benoit itself was totally isolated. It was pretty clear we were on our own. At this point, we just wanted off that goddamn island. And that's what led us to that maximum security prison. You see, some dickhead colonel by the name of Ryder White lied to get us to track down what he thought was a cure for this zombie plague. Well, that cure ended up turning White into a giant bloody maniac. Luckily, we hooked up with a prisoner who flew us out of there on the colonel's helicopter. We were off that goddamn island at last. And everyone we tried to save back on Benoit, well, they just didn't make it. Except for that little native girl, Nerima. We spotted that naval vessel just in time, as we were just about out of petrol. We couldn't believe how lucky we were to finally find a safe haven. So that's basically a summary of the first game, so you didn't even have to go watch it. Let's play on that now. Because it's just side quests, and the last game is just all, like, main story side quests, but, like, yeah, you go to a church and blah, blah, blah. It pretty much sums it up. Probably still do. I'm wearing headphones, so. Get your hands off me! What the hell? What is going on here? Uh, get off me! Uh, get it off me! Safe get it right. off! What's with the cops? Sorry, but I can't take any chances. My orders are to take you into custody and transport you to a secure quarantine area. And who the hell are you? Lieutenant Colonel Samuel Hardy. Don't resist and you'll be fine. We just need to be sure you don't pose Man, a threat. we no threat. The threat's on Benoit. You have any idea what's happening back there? We have an idea. We're hoping you can help us fill in the details. Especially her. You keep the hell away from her. Frank Serpo. I should have guessed. Are you the one in charge of this clusterfuck? Watch yourself with this guy. This freak would sell out his own mother. If he had one. Take the immune down to the lab. The two others will come with me. Lab? Uh, hey, do we look like goddamn guinea pigs I'm to you? I'm a citizen of the USA, man. I got motherfucking rights. Back off, Serpo. But just stay out of it. <laughs> Man. 
Don't do that again. One less immune won't make any difference. Now take him to the lab. You may have command over Palanai, but on this ship, I'm in charge and I have my orders. Your orders are to follow my orders, Colonel. Would you like me to call your superiors? I said Colonel in the chat, in the in the text box. Just call him Colonel. It's Colonel. Somebody tell me it's the same the thing. Is going on I'm, here. I'm just saying that they mess up on the subtitles. Please wait while we load your game. Now oh, they added a bit more blood onto the loading screen. Big difference. Graphics are pretty much the same as well. What? You could get your melee attack interrupted now. No. I just like they have a very hard time to time to I've already administered three doses. So how much longer? You said we'd have results by now. Sir, this is uncharted territory. We'll need another day at least. Just be careful. We don't want them dying on us. What about the native woman, Yerima? That's a more complicated case. She's being taken to another location. Don't worry. I'm keeping a close eye. Oh, God. Uh, my head. Uh, Those acting oh, skills, though. What the hell happened? Uh, motherfuckers drugged us. <laughs> Who are you? Hey, we're talking to you. I'm nobody, really. You've been bitten. How long has it been? Long enough. I guess it doesn't affect me. So you immune, too? So it seems. What? They plant you here to spy on us. <laughs> right, that's why I'm beat to shit like this. It's all part of my cover. So, they tested you too? Yeah. I'm guessing they're trying to figure out why we're all immune to this. How'd you get here? I was a soldier before the shit hit the fan. Part of a huge humanitarian search and rescue operation. And then that civilian arrived. So both. Right. Suddenly, the military was no longer in charge, and the rescue operation was called off. So what are they up to? All I know is there's a naval blockade around the entire archipelago. No one's allowed in or out. Whatever the fuck is going on, there's nothing to do with humanitarian efforts. That's pretty clear. Christ, I'm still losing from these bloody drugs. That's why I'm not playing this here. I'm not, right? Oh. She was like, this is pretty I was like, I'm not Where playing this game. Where the hell's What, did they take him while I was out? So the graphics are a bit Shit, more man. HD, it's about it. Long am I gonna be locked up? For an old game, it's Colonel amazing. Hyde, the ship's been compromised. If you're down in the hold, I'm opening all the cell doors. I better get the hell out of here while I still can. <laughs> Maybe it just seems more Everybody's HD because I'm on an HD TV. <laughs> Using an old 28 inch bad. full HD TV that I got for Christmas a year ago. That's now my sister's because I'm not using my big TV because it's not compatible for my Elgato. And it's like, yeah, because it's not HD. My, my TV, this TV is, so I guess that's probably why. Because the TV I was playing it on before was an old, like, it was the TVs that were still fat. Like, Ow. So that's probably why it's HD, it's probably the same quality. Better find it's myself a weapon. Find a weapon, alright. Well, you got the gif of it. I'm gonna edit here, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. And, uh, hopefully I will, uh, see you all later. Um, bye.